Future Health is one of the largest family stem cell banks in Europe, collecting samples from over 50 countries around the world. Its financial strength, size and number of years in business guarantee parents the safe and long-term storage of their samples. Future Health was the first private stem cell storage facility in the world to be certified and licensed as a human tissue bank by the Human Tissue Authority of the UK Department of Health in 2004. Future Health strictly follows the European directives for the storage of human tissues and cells. We have been licensed by the Human Tissue Authority of the UK Department of Health. In addition, we have received a blood establishment authorization by the Medicines and Healthcare Products Regulatory Agency, which enables us to safely handle blood and its byproducts. By following strict operating procedures, we ensure the highest possible quality of processing and long-term cryopreservation of stem cells and human tissues. How stem cells work. Stem cells are multipotent cells that are considered to be the building blocks of life. They have been used in a wide range of medical conditions including transplantation for leukemias. They have also been used in regenerative medicine therapies. So far over 600 different clinical trials are ongoing with regard to hemopoietic stem cells and over 100 for mesenchymal stem cells. Here at Future Health we store a wide variety of different cell types. There are two main types of stem cells found, hematopoietic stem cells which are predominantly found in the blood and mesenchymal stem cells which are found in different tissues. Mesenchymal stem cells have been used to treat a wide variety of different conditions into including cartilage and cardiac repair, whereas hematopoietic stem cells have been used to treat a wide variety of different blood disorders including leukemias. Cord blood and cord tissue collection. Our cord blood collection kit contains all the consumables needed for the successful collection of the sample. Our cord tissue collection kit contains a cord shipping tube with a special solution and our own unique cord tissue preservation tablet. All the consumables are individually wrapped in sterile packaging and are provided as part of the collection kit by Future Health, according to the UK Department of Health's accredited procedures. Kits are assembled and individually checked before shipping. Cord blood collection procedure. After the baby is born, the healthcare professional will collect the cord blood. The Future Health cord blood collection bag has two sterile needles to maximize the volume of cord blood collected. Before the collection takes place, the cord must be dried and thoroughly disinfected to ensure the blood is collected in a sterile manner. The needle cover is removed and the first needle is inserted into the blood vessel at the lowest part of the umbilical cord, as close to the clamp as possible. The cord blood procedure is repeated with the second needle, but at the top end of the cord near the placenta. Gentle agitation of the bag will ensure that the blood and the anticoagulant in the collection bag are thoroughly mixed. The cord blood sample is then placed in the thermal insulated transportation kit and handed to the birthing partner who is then responsible for arranging the transportation to future health. Cord tissue collection procedure. The cord tissue sample should be taken as soon as the cord blood sample has been collected. The preservation tablet is added to the solution and allowed to dissolve. The cord is cleaned thoroughly. A 15 cm section of the cord is cut cleaned again and placed in the shipping tube. All the consumables are individually wrapped in sterile packaging and are provided as part of the collection kit by Future Health, according to the UK Department of Health's accredited procedures. Our approved medical courier safely delivers your baby's cord blood and tissue to Future Health. Sample reception. Samples are received daily from countries across Europe, the Middle East and Africa for processing using the strict guidelines specified by the Human Tissue Authority. Future Health's state-of-the-art facilities are located close to East Midlands Airport, which is our courier's central European hub. This ensures the samples are received on a timely basis from all the countries that we operate in.
Each sample received by us is positively identified with a unique sample code number. The contents of the box are checked and all the necessary documentation recorded before processing of the sample begins. Cord blood processing. Stem cell separation and preservation is carried out by specialised laboratory personnel. The sample is processed within sterile clean rooms under strictly controlled conditions. Highly specialised computer controlled separation equipment is used. A closed system processing kit ensures the sterility of the stem cells. The system separates the whole cord blood sample into three components. Red blood cells, plasma and stem cells. Cord tissue processing. Staff entering the laboratory have to wear sterile full body suits completely covering the body from head to toe. The samples are processed in the sterile environment of a clean room. The sterility is constantly monitored by the use of agar plates in the work area. The cord tissue sample is cleaned, disinfected and then processed. We extract mesenchymal stem cells from the cord and culture them in order to ensure the viability of a sample. Freezing and long-term storage. So what we're going to do now is introduce cryopreservative into our buff coat bag which contains our stem cells. The reason we do this is because we want to preserve our cells in minus 190 degrees. The final sample is stored in a cryo bag. The cryo bag is divided into two independent chambers permitting the multiple use of each sample. A smaller section can be used for expansion therapy. Once the cryopreservative has been added to the cryo bag, it is sealed and placed in an external protective bag. The double bag sample is placed in a metal canister for additional protection against possible mechanical damage. The metal canisters are barcoded with the same unique number as the cryo bag. The sample is gradually frozen in a controlled rate freezer in order to protect the cells during the freezing procedure. Finally, it is placed in the vapour phase of liquid nitrogen storage tank for long-term storage. This prevents cross-contamination between the samples. This is one of our many liquid nitrogen storage tanks. This holds about 8,000 stem cell samples. These are very, very secure. They will survive for 10 days without any liquid nitrogen, without any electricity, therefore giving us a very, very secure storage system. Sample release. When a sample has been requested for release, the sample code is cross checked, the barcodes match, and then the sample is transferred from the storage tank into a protective canister. and then to a cryo shipper. The sample will remain frozen until it arrives at its final destination.
testing. A series of tests is performed on each and every sample in order to ensure the quality, viability and sterility. Blood count. A blood count is performed before and after processing in order to record the number of different types of cells present in the sample. CD34 Latest technology, flow cytometry equipment is used to identify specific types of stem cells. PCR ELISA This is our fully automated screening lab that we have where we carry all tests out on site. We look for bloodborne viruses and it gives us complete confidence and control over the processes. We use PCR to detect bloodborne viruses which is a gold standard and this may pick up viruses that other methods might not be able to detect. Cell cultivation. Mesenchymal stem cells are cultured in order to ensure the viability of each sample. Future Health has already established itself as a global leader within its industry for the collection, processing and storage of cord blood stem cells and cord tissue stem cells. In 2012, we'll introduce a variety of new services for cells derived from the teeth, immune system and adipose tissue. In 2010, Future Health received the prestigious Queen's Award for International Trade. So I hope you've enjoyed your tour of our state-of-the-art facilities.